Do you know that the liver is the only organ in the human body that can regenerate itself? That's right. The liver can grow back to its original size and shape, even if up to 90% of it is removed or damaged. This amazing ability is due to the presence of certain compounds that stimulate the growth and repair of liver cells. Some of these compounds are naturally produced by the body, while others can be obtained from external sources, such as herbs, foods, and supplements. Your liver is one of the most vital organs in our body, performing over 500 functions, such as detoxifying the blood, producing bile, regulating hormones, and storing vitamins and minerals. However, if you are overweight or have a poor diet, then you may have fat accumulation in your liver, which can lead to inflammation, scarring, and eventually liver failure. This condition is known as non-alcoholic fatty liver disease and affects millions of people worldwide. That's why it is essential to take care of our liver and provide it with the special nutrients it needs to stay healthy and perform its vital roles. In this video, we will reveal the best seven vitamins that can actually repair liver damage according to studies. So, without further ado, let's get started. Number one, choline. Choline is a nutrient that your body needs for many things, like making cell membranes, producing a brain chemical called acetylcholine, and breaking down fats. So, why is choline good for your liver? Well, your liver is the organ that processes and stores fats, and choline helps with that. Choline helps your liver make a substance called phosphatidylcholine, which is part of the cell membranes that protect your liver cells from damage. Choline also helps your liver transport fats out of the liver and into the bloodstream, where they can be used for energy or stored in other tissues. If you don't get enough choline, your liver can get overloaded with fats and become inflamed. This can lead to a condition called fatty liver disease, which can cause scarring, cirrhosis, and even liver cancer. For example, a study of 57 people with fatty liver disease found that taking two grams of choline per day for 12 weeks significantly improved their liver function and reduced their liver fat. You can get choline from foods like eggs, meat, fish, dairy, and some veggies, but you might not get enough from your diet alone. That's why some people take choline supplements to boost their intake. The recommended dosage for choline is 550 milligrams per day for men and 425 milligrams for women. Number two, milk thistle. Milk thistle is a plant that has been used for centuries as a natural remedy for various health problems, especially those affecting the liver. Milk thistle contains a group of compounds called silymarin, which have anti-inflammatory, antioxidant, and antifibrotic effects on the liver cells. According to studies, Silymarin can stimulate the regeneration of liver tissue and prevent toxins from entering the liver cells. Other studies have also found that milk thistle can reduce liver inflammation, improve liver function tests, and prevent liver scarring. What's more impressive here is that other laboratory and animal studies have also found that milk thistle can inhibit the growth of cancer cells, induce apoptosis, or cell death and prevent the formation of blood vessels that feed tumors. To get these benefits, you can take milk thistle capsules, which usually contain a standardized extract of silymarin, the active ingredient in milk thistle. The recommended dose is about 420 milligrams of silymarin per day, divided into two or three doses. Number three, artichoke leaf. Artichoke leaf is the extract of the leaves of the artichoke plant, which is a type of thistle that grows in the Mediterranean region. Artichoke leaf has been used for centuries in traditional herbal medicine for various ailments, especially for digestive and liver problems. In the science world, they call it hepatoprotective. Basically, it's like a shield for your liver. Animal studies have shown that artichoke leaf extract can protect the liver and may even help liver cells regenerate. In other studies, Artichoke leaf extract has also been found to reduce fat and cholesterol levels in the liver. This is super important because high levels of fat and cholesterol can lead to liver disease. To reap these benefits, you can take artichoke leaf supplements, which are typically taken orally and are most commonly available in capsule or gel cap forms. 
The dosage often used by adults is 320 to 640 milligrams of artichoke leaf extract, taken by mouth three times daily. Before we continue, if you have been enjoying the video so far, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss more videos like this. Number 4. Dandelion Root Dandelion Root, scientifically known as Taraxacum officinale, has been used for centuries for its medicinal properties. It is rich in antioxidants, which are substances that protect your cells from harmful free radicals. Free radicals are molecules that can cause inflammation and oxidative stress, which can damage your liver and other organs. By consuming dandelion root, you can help reduce inflammation and oxidative stress in your liver and prevent further damage. Dandelion root also stimulates bile production, which is a fluid that helps your liver digest fats and remove waste products. Bile also helps your gallbladder function properly and prevents the formation of gallstones. In one study, researchers found that dandelion root extract protected the liver tissue of mice exposed to toxic levels of acetaminophen. Dandelion root supplements can be taken in different forms, such as capsules, tablets, tinctures, or liquid extracts. The typical dosage for dandelion root capsules is between 500 and 1500 milligrams per day, taken with or without food. If using fresh leaves to make tea, you can consume about 4 to 10 grams daily. Number 5. Vitamin E. Vitamin E is a fat-soluble vitamin that has antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. These properties can help protect the liver from oxidative stress, inflammation, and cell death, which are common problems in fatty liver disease. Some studies have suggested that vitamin E supplementation can improve some markers of liver health in people with fatty liver disease, especially those with non-alcoholic steatohepatitis, which is a more severe form of the condition. For example, vitamin E may lower the levels of certain liver enzymes in the blood, reduce the fat content and inflammation in the liver, and prevent the liver cells from ballooning or dying. The recommended daily intake for vitamin E for men and women is 15 mg daily or 22 international units, including women who are pregnant. Other than supplements, vitamin E can be found in foods such as nuts, seeds, vegetable oils, and green leafy vegetables, which are also good for liver health. Number 6. Glutathione Glutathione is a powerful antioxidant that is found in high concentrations in the liver. It plays a vital role in protecting the liver from toxins, free radicals, and inflammation. It also helps the liver to perform its many functions, such as metabolism, detoxification, and bile production. However, some factors can deplete the levels of glutathione in the liver, such as aging, stress, alcohol, drugs, infections, and diseases. When the liver is low in glutathione, it becomes more vulnerable to damage and dysfunction. This can lead to various liver problems, such as fatty liver disease, cirrhosis, hepatitis, and cancer. Fortunately, there are ways to boost the glutathione levels in the liver and improve its health. One way is to take glutathione supplements, either orally or intravenously. Studies have shown that glutathione supplements can improve the liver function and reduce the fat accumulation in people with fatty liver disease. Another way to increase the glutathione levels in the liver is to eat foods that are rich in glutathione or its precursors, such as cysteine, glycine, and glutamate. Some of these foods include garlic, onion, broccoli, spinach, eggs, meat, and dairy products. The recommended dosage for glutathione supplements varies from 2,500 to 2,000 milligrams per day but it is advisable to start with a low dose and increase gradually. Number seven, vitamin D. Vitamin D is a fat-soluble vitamin that is essential for many functions in the body, including bone health, immune system, and inflammation. But did you know that vitamin D also plays a major role in your liver health? Studies have shown that vitamin D deficiency may increase your risk of liver disease like cirrhosis, which is a condition where scar tissue replaces healthy liver tissue and impairs its function. 
Vitamin D deficiency is common in people with liver conditions like cirrhosis because the damaged liver cannot process vitamin D properly from food or supplements. This can lead to malnutrition, which worsens the symptoms and complications of cirrhosis. According to studies, increasing your vitamin D intake can help reduce inflammation in the liver, which is a key factor in liver disease progression. Vitamin D can also help regulate cell growth, differentiation, and apoptosis, which are processes that affect liver tissue repair and regeneration. The recommended daily intake of vitamin D is 600 international units. You can also get vitamin D by exposing your skin to sunlight, which triggers vitamin D synthesis in your body. You can also get vitamin D from foods like fatty fish, egg yolks, cheese, and fortified milk. So these were the best seven vitamins or compounds that can actually repair your liver, according to studies. However, before taking any supplements, make sure to consult your doctor first, especially if you have any medical conditions or are taking any medications. Also, remember that supplements are not a substitute for a healthy diet and lifestyle. You should also eat a balanced diet that is rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean proteins, and healthy fats. Avoid foods that are high in sugar, salt, trans fats, and processed ingredients. Drink plenty of water and limit your alcohol intake. And finally, exercise regularly and maintain a healthy weight. By following these tips, you can improve your liver health and prevent further damage. Now, we want to hear from you. Did you try some of these vitamins before? Did you experience some of these benefits? Share with us your experiences and opinions in the comments below. We'd love to hear them. Thanks for watching.